True 3A, M, experience, this happened when I was 7, and I was sleeping in my parents' room, because I did not have my own room at the time, my dad was working at the casino down in Lachlan, which was about 30 minutes away from my house at the time in a housing complex where every house looked exactly the same, except with different colored shackles on the top of the houses, it was around 2.32 in the morning when I woke up to go to the bathroom, and get a glass of water before going back to sleep, I spent a while in the bathroom, and since I did not have a phone at the time, I was playing with my old Spongebob knows your name doll from around 2001, I was a complete Spongebob fan. As I had Patrick and Squidward toys in my house's computer room, where all the toys of mine were kept in the closet, I finished going to the bathroom, and proceeded to go out to the kitchen where my grandfather was asleep and left the television on, I just left it on, as he tends to keep it on 24-7. It seemed a bit tense in the kitchen, but I just ignored it, I poured myself a glass of water from our old water dispenser from when we lived in Tucson, I went back to my parents' room, and I laid back down after drinking my water, around 10 minutes passed, and I could not fall back to sleep. I looked for my mother's iPad, which I usually just watch YouTube videos until I fall asleep, I found the iPad case, opened it, and it was dead, I put it back where I found it, and just laid there, two minutes passed, and I suddenly had the urge to sit up, I followed the urge and sat up. Stuck staring in the corner where my parents' lamp is, it turned off randomly, and I saw some black figure, it choked me until I could wake up my mother, who was right next to me on the bed, she got up, and I could barely speak, I was completely out of breath. She grabbed me and ran into the living room where my grandfather was sleeping, and told me to sleep out there for the rest of the night, the exact day after that, I was sitting on the couch with my Spongebob doll and my Woody doll, my Woody doll would not stop going off. So we had to take out the batteries, a few hours after that, the Woody doll went off again, but this time in a much louder manner, to where you could hear it from all the way from the back of my house, it just said, reach for the sky. I grabbed it and checked the batteries after it was done, saying the phrase, the batteries were not even in there, so it just makes it even more confusing, not to mention that my Spongebob doll said, I'm going to kill you, James. Which is my name, but was never programmed into the doll, nor was the phrase, so it just makes it even more creepier, I'm 12 now, and every time I wake up at around 3 a.m., I feel something watching over me. Thanks for watching, if you enjoyed the video hit that like button to support my work. And as always enjoy the fear my dear.